Hello friend, I am Ajit. Today I am going to discuss one more important drug that is metformin hydrochloride. Metformin hydrochloride that is mainly used for type 2 diabetes mellitus that means uh, hyperglycemic condition when blood glucose elevated in our um, blood. So the drug dose that is 500 milligram and the brand name is Okamet and this drug is manufactured by Cipla and one more important thing that we should know about that is Okamet 500 this is the uncoated tablet then how can you will differentiate between coating tablet and uncoating tablet this is the uncoating tablet if the middle border is there that is that should be uncoated tablet and one more important thing that we should know that is the schedule high schedule G drug we should not prescribe sorry we should not uh, dispense without prescription so prescription is mandatory for this drug and uh, warning is there that is to be sold by retail on the prescription of a registered medical practitioner only and this drug mainly come under biguanides biguanides drug and the uh, drug is enhanced peripheral action of insulin and the drug do not cause hypoglycemia and this is the first line drug for obese patient if the, if the patient is obese so you can give this drug this is a first line first line drug for the diabetes mellitus and uh, by combination you can give with insulin and sulfonyl ureas to potentiate the um, biguanides action action example of biguanide that is metformin metformin that is 500 milligram and one more there is the drug that is penformin if you see the mechanism of that uh, metformin inhibit inhibition of hepatic gluconeogenesis and indication indication what purpose this medicine is used this medicine is mainly used for hyper hyperglycemia for decreasing blood glucose level and one more important thing this medicine also used for polycystic ovary syndrome PCOS and that medicine is used for type 2 diabetes mellitus we know mainly diabetes type mellitus is two types type 1 and type 2 and this is mainly used for type 2 diabetes mellitus and contraindication contraindication means at what situation we should avoid this drug if the patient is renal dysfunction is patient is there or the patient is metabolic acidosis is there or hepatic dysfunction is there so that time we should not prescribe this medicine and one more important thing the main mechanism of the drug is inhibition of hepatic gluconeogenesis so what is mean by gluconeogenesis gluconeogenesis means synthesis of glucose from non carbohydrate compound what are the non carbohydrate compound that is lactate pyruvate and glycerol and one more important thing that we should know that is biguanide one class of drug an example is metformin and fenformin fenformin also one drug that is come under biguanide so fenformin is banded because of lactic acidosis so in 2020 2003 the metformin is banded due to lactic acidosis so this is all about uh, metformin hydrochloride so one more important thing that is hydrochloride why they mention hydrochloride hydrochloride that is salt form of drug HCl to better absorption of the drug if the absorption is mm, good so bioavailability will be good so this is the drug for pass line drug for type 2 diabetes mellitus or hypoglycemic patient thank you for watching this video thank you